Former President of the United States is being remembered this week in Washington and Houston, but he's also being remembered by a close friend he made in this province. NTV's Colleen Lewis with the story. As tributes and memorial services are being held for former President George Bush in the United States, in Grand Falls, Windsor, former fishing lodge owner Bill Lynch is remembering a fishing buddy who, over a period of 10 years, became a close friend. I mean, he was a very gentle man. Uh, he had a lot of respect for, I'd say, everybody that he ever met. And certainly, in turn, he had a lot of respect for him. But anyway, uh, I always found very pleasant and easy to get along with, and uh, over the years we became good friends. There were many memories along the way, including the time Mr. Lynch went to Houston and sang Amazing Grace for the President and his guests. Anyway, we had a function that evening, a dinner and, and a function, and uh, certainly as he always did, every time we'd meet, he wanted me to probably sing a song for him. So anyway, uh, there was a big audience, there was a couple of thousand people there, and uh, certainly he made the request again. Then there was the time on the Beta Spare Highway, when the president ended up being pulled from a bog. But in the meantime, he got out, just walked across the shoal part of the bog, went around a clump of trees, and I was watching him from the helicopter. But anyway, he never went very far, and one by I saw him disappear. So anyway, I got out. There was two Secret Service fellows there. Anyway, they came behind me, and when we got around the clump of woods, he was down in a bog hole, right to his armpits. But mostly, Mr. Lynch cherishes the memory of those quiet evenings after a day on the river with a friend who shared a love for fishing. You know, uh, when you're with a fellow most of the day like that, and then in the evening, you get time to sit back and relax and, you know, just uh, transfer uh, stories about the fishing and about the camps and about the rivers and everything. And I think that's what he enjoyed most. And I, I did, too, really, at the time. For NTV News, I'm Colleen Lewis in Grand Falls, Windsor.